Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to get a full 100% refund on your Xbox One games you accidentally bought. Coming up next on this refund tutorial. So I'm in the Microsoft store right now and I just purchased a game that I didn't want by accident. However, you cannot refund the game on your Xbox One. You actually have to jump over to your computer. So let's go ahead and switch to my computer right now. Now I'll show you where to go to get a refund on your Xbox One game. So go ahead and open up a web browser on your computer and then go to xbox.com and press enter. In the upper right, go ahead and sign in to your Microsoft account and then select it when it pops up and then go to your Microsoft account right here and select this and it will take you to this page. When this fully loads on your screen, go ahead and go to Microsoft account payment and billing and then go to manage and this screen will pop up with a bunch of different information like your credit card information and your order history which will be on the left hand side right under your credit card. Let's go ahead and go to view order history. And this is our order history. You'll see everything listed in a chronological order from today's date. I just gifted a game Rocket League to one of my friends, Killers91. And if you look on the left hand side, you'll see all in progress and then return slash refunded games. So let's go ahead and select that. And when this loads, your eligible refunded games will show up here. However, there's some stipulations on what games can be refunded. So let's go ahead and go over those listings now. Now games are eligible for self-service refunds within 14 days of the purchase and there has to be less than two hours of playtime across all the accounts for the game. Now this does not include any DLC, season pass, or any extra add-ons for the games for self-service refunds. And to get a self-service refund, the game must be downloaded and launched before going over to the web page and asking for a refund. So you have to download the game and launch it on like the PlayStation 4. And you must wait at least one day after the game has released before requesting a refund. Now those are pertaining to self-service refunds. Suppose the game's still not listing on the self-service refunds. What would we do from then? Well, you do have one more option. You can actually contact Microsoft by going to the screen and going down to the bottom right and going to contact us and go to contact support. And this virtual agent will pop up and type in Xbox refund and it will pop up a menu. I want a refund or an exchange. What type of product would you like to return? Digital games? or subscription, what type of digital product, app, or game. Was this an Xbox related purchase of a digital product? Yes. And then it's gonna say how to request an Xbox refund before you get started, blah, blah, blah. Go to request an Xbox refund web form. And I'll open another web page for you and it'll take you through this listing. Go ahead and read through this and select yes or no at the bottom. Are you currently signed into a Microsoft account that was used to make this purchase, yes. Do you have the order number for this purchase? We do have the order number because it will be under the under your order history. It will be listed there. So go ahead and press yes. And then choose the one that applies to you. I purchased my item by accident. The accidental purchase category only applies to purchases made by yourself. Someone else other than you made the purchase, select no. I'm going to go and press yes because I made the purchase. And then it finally pops up the refund form. So let's go ahead and request a refund via the web form. And you will have to type in all this information, uh, displaying the title of the game, your name, last name, select a refund reason, and some additional information. And then go ahead and press submit at the bottom. And it may take up to 72 hours for Microsoft to give you a response. So if this Xbox refund video did help you out, gave you some information, go ahead and hit that like button and subscribe to my Xbox One Help channel down below and check out more videos coming up next on Your Six Studios.